Hello YouTube, Oli the Rebedo here. In this video, I'm going to upgrade this ZenBook UX390UA. It also works for UX390 series, which is the ZenBook 3. A reminder, please back up all your data before doing this, as replacing the SSD will lose your data. All the data will be stored on the old SSD. Before I start the procedure, I shut down the laptop. I then started removing all the screws that held the bottom cover in place. I then lift up the water cover and I mean the laptop. I first disconnect the battery using a spudger to pry the battery connector out. I then use a screwdriver to remove the screw securing the SSD in place. Using a spudger, I pry, lift and pull the SSD out. I transfer the heat shield to the new SSD. I then pop in the new SSD to the socket. I push it in. It took me some time to align this and insert it correctly. I use the screw to secure the new SSD in place. I then remove the old SSD. And finally, reconnect the battery. Ensure battery connectors are aligned correctly before pushing it in. I finally install the back cover back into place I install the screws back in place
I then try to boot up the laptop. It booted up with the BIOS, then reboot itself. At first, I thought the SSD is not found. Hence, decide to check and receive the SSD. And then, this is the laptop again to check the SSD and we see. It is the same procedure as removing and installing the SSD. I then install the cover without screwing in for me to test the laptop. I power on the laptop. And I allow it to move it to BIOS. I went through the BIOS settings to check whether the SSD is detected. I checked already, it is detected. Hence, I can proceed with the Windows installation. I then power off the laptop. I install the screws that secure the bottom cover back in place. I then connect the USB drive containing the Windows installation media to the hub. Then connect the hub to the laptop. Finally, I connect power to the hub.
I then turn on the laptop. It booted to the Windows installation media. I then proceed installing Windows onto the laptop, new SSD. I decide to stop here as the installation as well as the setup take time. I decided not to show myself setting up the top. This is what happened after the installation of Windows and the setup. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like this video, share this video, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you really like the channel. Please donate. The link to donate is in the description below.